Gus Fullerton, when, uh, when I first met this young couple at Houston's restaurant for lunch one day, uh, and they're not the only couple in this room that I have met prior to their both being in dental school and then getting married. They didn't tell me the whole story, so I had to figure it out. And the one theme was love. And that really, very frankly, I will tell you is what dentistry is about. It really is about loving the people you treat, doing things for them. I happen to be fortunate enough to have to have met Kay Huff many years ago. And then this is one, <clears throat> Kay is terrific. And then to have been through dentistry, and I'm going to tell you, I know more dentists than anyone you have ever met in your life. <laughs> and, and I am very fortunate. But today we have, you know, about 50-50 male and female. You know, they marry each other. <laughs> and, and when I went to dental school, there was one female in my class. She was married and had two kids. She wasn't available. <laughs> so it's, it's changed a lot, but I'll tell you what, we've got some beautiful women yes. who have come into dentistry and some great guys, and it is really fun to watch them connect. The thing is, I have 55 years of experience of knowing where their lives are going to go. They don't really know. I know. <laughs> That's a gift God gave me was to know these people. And very frankly, it was to find really great people. I mean, in the heart, they are great people and will take care of other people like you. They may not give you a discount. <laughs> There's something Kay told me about. It's called overhead. <laughs> There's something... I won't let Bobby touch my teeth because I was mean to him when he was little. <laughs> you're, you're smart. <laughs> they do. You do check them out for needles. But we teach them to get painless injection. So believe me, they're going to do well. And I'm going to tell you, I'm so happy for y'all to, tonight for Samantha and Bobby both that I just one little lunch at, at Houston's, and all of this is where this is today, many years later. But it's worth it all, and the rest of your life you're going to benefit. And, and it makes me so happy, and I appreciate being here, because I am the one in dentistry that probably is the happiest person. You find me another person that's happier than I am. It may be Kay. <laughs> it's certainly not my wife. <laughs> if you ever know Trisha Fullerton in dentistry, I believe Trisha is the most beloved woman in dentistry. Because all of these students over the years have been like our kids. Now y'all are like our grandkids. <laughs> you know, that's what happens. But just, yeah, you would really love to hear Trisha, but she just doesn't like to talk. <laughs> but again, congratulations, Bobby and, and Samantha, both for y'all. And again, you have so much to look forward to. And the, the reason that I do, and I have to be honest, the reason that I come for these occasions is I love cake. <laughs> I see a young lady cutting the cake, so weddings and celebrations, and I, I do love cake. <laughs> anyway, best wishes, and it's nice to have met an extended family too, quite a family that's uh, represented. <laughs> yeah. I noticed that you all have teeth. <laughs> Thank you.